Hey everyone, this is Daily Dose of Medicine. In this video, we will talk about what is ehrlichiosis. It's caused by the transmission of the Ehrlichia bacteria through the bite of infected ticks. It's primarily affecting the white blood cells and can lead to flu-like symptoms. On the left side, you can see Lone Star tick, and on the right side, you can find Deer tick. These are primary vectors for transmitting the bacteria to the humans. The sticks commonly found in grassy or wooded areas. Now let's start with the signs and symptoms. We have fever, chills, headache, muscle aches, fatigue, nausea, vomiting, diarrhea, cough, and joint pain. But in severe cases of, or if left untreated, ehrlichiosis can lead to more serious symptoms like respiratory failure, kidney failure, and central nervous system involvement. Blood tests can detect changes in white blood cell counts and platelet levels, but more specific tests like PCR and serologic tests can identify the presence of Ehrlichia or anaplasma DNA or antibodies in the blood. But it's important to prevent the stick bites to avoid ehrlichiosis and other tick-borne infections. For prevention, I would recommend wearing protective clothing like long sleeves and pants when in tick-prone areas. You can use tick repellents on exposed skin and clothing. You can check your body and clothing for ticks after spending time outdoors. It's typically treated with antibiotics. Doxycycline is the most commonly used antibiotic and it's often effective. Treatment usually started as soon as the diagnosis is suspected, even before confirmatory tests available due to potential severity of the infection. And the sooner the treatment begins, the better the outcome. So remember, if you suspect you have been exposed to ticks and are experiencing the symptoms, it's important to seek medical attention promptly for proper diagnosis and treatment. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to watch our folate deficiency signs, iron-rich foods, cat eye disease video. See you on the next one.